Hello, I'm Mary Beth McDaniel Zellen, daughter of Dr. T.C. McDaniel, and today we're here to talk about our TDS meter, Total Dissolved Solids. Total Dissolved Solids are chemicals, metals, other compound pollutants that can be found in your tap water. So today, I'm going to show you how to use the TDS meter so you can find out an acceptability range for the different types of water. We're going to look at distilled water today, reverse osmosis water, and tap water. So I'll start with tap water because water is the first thing that Dr. McDaniel would teach to all of his patients. What type of water are you drinking? Are you consuming distilled water? Are you consuming reverse osmosis or even tap water, which is not great. EPA standard for tap water is under 400 parts per million, which is not great. Because you want to make your teas, your coffees, your rice, your soups, pastas out of good clean water. So we have our tap water here. I'm going to put the reverse osmosis water here. And this is our distilled water. So I've unpacked our TDS meter, comes in a nice case, and you would keep it covered to keep the components safe. I'm going to shake it out a little bit so there's no excessive water in it because I had done a test before. So right now you'll see it's green and it's zero. I'm going to stick it into the cup that has the regular tap water. It's coming out red already. It's reading 300, oh, now it's up to 402. So, let's start that again. This is our tap water reading at 395. It just bounced back green. So now we're back at zero and we're going to test our reverse osmosis water. Reverse osmosis is coming in at about 30, 30 parts per million. And this is your distilled water. Going to zero that out. You hit the middle button to zero it out. Stick it in the distilled water and it is zero. Distilled water is the steam that rises when you boil it. It's the pure H2O, the two hydrogen molecules with one oxygen molecule. It's, it's the water that is invented by God, the best water there is. So this is our TDS meter. It's a great learning tool to test your tap water at home, see what you're drinking. You do want it to be under ideally 50 and on the back of this it explains 0, 50 up to 100, 200, 300, uh, keeping it minimally under that EPA standard of 400. So you can order this product online and if you ever have any questions please give us a call and we would love to help you out. Thanks so much.